Uh, good morning, everyone. Today I'll be presenting uh, deep reinforcement learning for subpixel neural tracking. Uh, this is work done here at Imperial College London. So what we do is we're interested in tracking thin structures in biomedical images. Um, this differs from segmentation in that we want to get geometrical information about the path of a thin structure such as a blood vessel, a axon, or a muscle fiber. And the way we do this is we formulate it as an RL problem. Um, so we uh, take a, an axon image, and we turn this into a, an RL system with states, actions, and rewards. And then we place an artificial agent in the environment and uh, teach it to track the axon, axon successfully. So for our training data, we've designed a synthetic axon generator. So what this does is it gives us 32,000 realistic axon images, um, which we then train the RL algorithm on. And we're able to successfully transfer this to real microscopy data from a mouse cortical data set um, and, and achieve good results. We approve our performance um, by fine tuning on a limited amount of labeled microscopy images. Um, and we also show that the entropy of the policy network actually gives us a measure of uncertainty, um, which is unique to this method. So the reinforcement learning environment that we create, um, the environment is actually a 2D grayscale microscopy image. Um, the observation given to the reinforcement learning agent uh, is a, a basic view around the agent's position, um, a view of the historical path of the agent. And we also provide to the uh, critic network of the RL algorithm uh, a centerline view of the axon. The action space of the agent are uh, continuous action, action, actions um, at subpixel level, corresponding to a displacement in the range of uh, negative four to four pixels. And the reward function that the agent receives is the average integral of the intensity uh, between the agent's current and next location. So we use a, uh, an actor critic architecture. Um, this is a reinforcement learning architecture composed of two convolutional neural networks. Um, the first is the uh, actor network. This uh, determines the policy of the agent, and the, the outputs of this network are two values corresponding to a beta distribution from which we sample the agent's actions. Um, and the value of the states is evaluated by the critic network. Um, this, as you can see, gets an extra input, which is the, the centerline image of the axon, and this allows it to evaluate the um, performance of the actor. So here you can see our results. Um, so the, the first is the um, deep reinforcement learning um, method just trained on synthetic data and tested on 20 manually labeled microscopy images. Um, and as you can see, it uh, compares. You're out of time. I'm out of time, OK. Uh, and there's an example there of the um, traces. Thank you. 